If you're wondering what products to sell on your dropshipping stores, do not go anywhere because in this video, I'm going to share with you the top 10 dropshipping products that you need to sell on your stores for the month of September. Not only will I show you what products you need to be selling, but I'll also show you all of the seller's information, who's selling them, what ads they're running on this product, what engagement they're getting, and where they are sourcing the product from along with their profit potential. So as you see, there's so much coming up in this video, and this is a great way to learn what products will sell on your stores. Quick intro and let's go. Welcome back everyone, I'm Liran from AutoDS, the content manager, and as you know, in this video, you're going to learn what are the top 10 products to sell on your dropshipping stores for the month of September. But one second before I start with the list, do not forget that our YouTube channel is packed with these kinds of videos, product finding, case studies, how to build your dropshipping store from A to Z, full free courses, and so much more. So do not forget to subscribe and like and share this video if you appreciate the value. Now, having said that, let's jump straight into the action and learn about the top 10 products products that we want to sell on our dropshipping stores for the month of September and of course for the months coming after that. We use our databases and our personal and professional experience gathering all of this information so that we can share it with you so that you can create your own success story. So now without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. All of this information, I'm getting it from our blog channel, which you can find at autods.com slash blog. And this video will also be embedded into this article. So if you're the type that likes to read, you can go ahead and skip to the link right below this video. But if you're the type that likes to watch, stay here because I always like to add additional bonus content into my videos. Starting at number one on our list, cordless air duster. This is what the product looks like. Let's dive into the details. Now this cordless air duster is selling for $89. It's being sourced at $59 meaning your profit potential here is about $30 per sell for every time you make a transaction without counting, of course, your selling fees. So if you have a selling channel on eBay, your average fee that you're gonna pay there is anywhere between 12 to 15%. If you're selling on Shopify, it could be similar. It also depends on your payment settings. So do take your selling channel fees into consideration, but even when you do, you're still making a hefty amount of profit right here. So let's dive into this cordless air duster. Your target audience for selling this product fits both male and female anywhere between the ages of 20 and 50. Marital status fits both married and single. That's if you want to run targeted ads on this product. Now let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. Who's selling this product and what type of engagement they are getting. And the reason that we are doing this is to be able to get a glimpse into the competition, into insights on our competition, to the amount of engagements that our competitors are getting when running ads on these products. So this is the seller's Facebook ad right here, 30% off and free shipping. He has almost 2 million views on this ad. Now he may have disabled comments, but you can see by the amount of views that this product is getting some, at least some engagement. And as you see, he's got a video right here. Just turn down the volume a little bit. He's got a nice uh, soundtrack in the background just to get you pumped up. And it shows you exactly what problem or what types of problems this product helps you solve. So as you see right here, this cordless air duster simply does what it's supposed to do. You can clean your PC components, your car, furniture, your keyboard, and of course, so much more. So what this does is it simply blows air and removes dust, dirt, and so forth from whatever you want to clean. So this is the ad that he's using. As I always recommend, use videos on your ads and also on your product pages because it provides the best visual experience and explanation on what this product is and of course, what problem it helps you solve. Many times your buyers are not even going to know that they need a product until you slam the ad in their face and then they realize hey, this is something that I want or need. And then they'll go on and purchase the product. That is called impulse purchases. And that is what we're on the lookout for. So this is the seller's website. And as you see, it has a pretty clean look. We got right to the product page by clicking on the Facebook ad. And because the product is in purple, you may have noticed that he pretty much made all his website complement that color. So he's got the top banner here also in purple. His call to action buttons, the buy now button is also in purple, which of course corresponds to the purple on the product. So he's doing something really smart here by making the colors relevant and making you have a smooth experience, a smooth visualization experience at that. And if we click on buy it now, 
we can see that he is selling this product for $79. So this is the product page. Let's take a quick look. So he's renaming it Numi trademark, which is his business name, as you can see right up here, numiofficial.com. So he's kind of rebranding this product, even though the product is not going to come in any Numi brand and it's not going to say Numi anywhere around the product or the product packaging. And that is because he is simply a white label dropshipper. If you guys don't know what that is, we have a white label dropshipping article and video on our YouTube channel and on our blog page. But this is simply where you take a product that was already manufactured as is and you simply drop ship it from the manufacturer or from the wholesaler directly to the end customer. And what happens here is you didn't actually brand your product because if you brand it, then you're going to have to purchase a minimum order quantity and then you're not really on the dropshipping business model. So he is simply calling it Numi on the product's name on the product page just to make you feel like this is a brand and that you are buying from a real big business. Now you can of course do something similar on your store, get your business name and name all of your products after your business even if the product doesn't really have that business logo attached to it or printed on it so numi cordless air duster for computer keyboard cleaning of course it's not just for that but that's what he decided to call it you can see that this website is created on shopify just by the basic layout and from the design that we're looking at here but it looks clean it looks good it's good enough to convert and that is good enough for us once again the product page is very clean it looks very good there's not too many things being slammed onto my face I like the way that it looks and you got the product description right here. You've got these icons to help increase your confidence as the buyer. So I know that he has free shipping, 12 month warranty, even though he's not really going to give you a 12 month warranty, but it does do the job of gaining your confidence as the shopper and secure checkout. Every checkout today on Shopify is pretty much secure, but yeah. So you've got the product description right here and bullet lists, which is very important to increase the readability and not just have a whole bunch of text bunched up together. Nobody is going to read through all of that. So this is much cleaner, looks better, and it has all of the product's main features and benefits listed in this bullet list. So that's another great thing that the seller did here. And he's got an embedded video right here. It's the same video that we saw on the Facebook ad and more images for this product. And if we continue scrolling down, we'll also get the customer's reviews, which is a another great method to help increase the customer's confidence in purchasing from your store. So you got the social proof right here, you got the testimonials. And by the way, the people who are leaving these reviews are most likely not from this website. They're leaving these reviews on AliExpress and he's simply using an app to import the reviews from AliExpress to his product page. Of course, we have videos and articles that explain how to do this using recommended Shopify apps when dropshipping with hosts like Shopify. Now let's see the supplier's website. So in this case, we found this product on AliExpress selling for around $59. So let's give it a look. We've got two different variations here, 6,000 and 15,000 mAh. Let's see what we're looking at when purchasing from him. He's got the built-in 15,000 mAh battery here. So that is the variation that we're looking at. So now we're at $49. And let's see how much for shipping. Well, shipping is gonna come free right here with tracking available, so that is great. We're always looking for shipping with tracking so that if a customer says that they didn't receive an item, we can just prove to him that he did and then we won't have to send any refunds. Or if there's any problem with the tracking and let's say the item got lost in transit, we can easily get our refund or send out a replacement using our supplier. So we found the product right here at $49, which is $10 cheaper than when we wrote this blog article when it was $59. So the supplier prices are always going to change sometimes for the better sometimes for the worse and that is why it's very important to work with price and stock monitoring that is when you're using an automation tool to change your prices according to price changes that are happening on your suppliers websites for products that you imported from them and also of course stock monitoring if they run out of stock you also want it to run out of stock on your store and all of this happens automatically so when we look at the profit potential here which was $30 not including your selling channel fees you're actually looking at $40 because the price dropped by $10 and the seller is still selling it for the same price. That is product number one on our list, cordless air duster. Now this doesn't mean that you need to work with only that one purple variation. You can purchase different variations. You can see other sellers on AliExpress and also other suppliers and you have a nice list of them on autods.com slash suppliers to understand who are all of the dropshipping suppliers that you can work with. And of course, it'll increase your reach into more and more wireless air dusters as you're seeing right here in front of me. Product number two on our list is Luminous Luxury Chandelier. Now this is a high ticket item, meaning 
meaning for every time you make a sale, you're gonna make some great profit here. And let's take a look at the numbers. So this luxury chandelier is selling for about $708 and it's being bought for about $213, or at least it was when, at the time we wrote this article, leaving you a profit potential of over $490 per sale. Selling one unit per day, is more than enough to make great profits on your dropshipping store, and that is just one sell per day. Now, if you wanna run Facebook ads on this product, you wanna target the male and the female audiences ages 30 to 50, both single and married, with an economic status of upper middle class, because people with financial problems are most likely not going to buy products like these. Now let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. So I scroll down to the seller's Facebook ad and I click on the link to get to it. And here we go, this is the seller's post. He's also got a video embedded, just turn down the volume. So he's also got a video embedded and it looks like the seller who's selling this product doesn't really have a video for it. So what the seller did here is he simply took images for different variations for this product and he's just giving you eye candy with all of that and saying, hey, head over to my store. This post right here got 515,000 views, which is more than enough to understand that there is good engagement going on with this product. And now let's take a look at his store. So I can also get to it from the blog article under the seller's website. Okay, so let's click on that link. And here we go, you got that spider chandelier, as he calls it. He's selling all kinds of different variations. Let's see what we're looking at here. We're looking at the 12 heads and the gold color with the warm white emitting color. So 12 heads, gold color, warm white. Let's see what we got. Now it's showing it to me in local currency, which isn't what we are all looking for. So let me just convert that really quick. 2,737 divided by about 3.4 is about $805. So let's just round that down to 800, which means he raised the price from when we wrote the article by about $100. Now let's take a look at his product page and analyze it really quick. Once again, the layout looks really clean. I don't like how I'm seeing all kinds of colors in the images, but I can't really blame him there because he simply took these images from the supplier's website and imported it to his own. So when you've got all this red over here, which doesn't really correspond with the rest of the colors here, there's not that much that you can do about it unless you wanna edit your own images. And he's got the product description right here, short and to the point with the important specifications, which you have to have. The buyer needs to know 100% what he's getting. And if it's an electronic product like this, you need as much specifications as possible. Get them from your supplier, make sure that you've got them laid out on the product page. And as you see here, we've got shipping info and refunds and returns. So it's really easy to get this information and you do have to click on it in order to get it, but it's nice to have it on the product page instead of having to navigate to the menu, maybe to the footer menu or maybe on the header menu. So it's nice to have it also on the product page and you'll only read about it if you click on it. So it's not taking up space if it doesn't have to. So here we've got the supplier's website. Let's click on it and take a look. So we've got the warm white emitting color and the lampshade color needs to be, was it 10 heads? Okay, so the 12 heads, warm white, cost $196 with free shipping to the United States, but tracking is not available. So that is not good. We always wanna look for tracking that is available and they do have it, but for a higher price. So if I add $154 just to get tracking, that is a hefty amount. On the other hand, you can go without tracking and if the customer didn't get the product and reaches out to you and tells you, hey, I didn't receive anything here and you can't really track it because you're not getting any tracking information and this is a high ticket product, it could be a little bit risky. But on the other hand, you can turn to the supplier, in this case, AliExpress and tell them the same thing. I didn't receive this product or my buyer didn't receive this product. And AliExpress also won't be able to track it because they didn't use tracking and the seller will be obliged to resend out another package. But if you wanna play it totally safe, add that extra $154 and get tracking information. So what are we looking at here? 154 plus 196. Let's take the worst case situation. So we're looking at $350 in costs. But if we're selling it for $800, then we've got about $450 here, not including selling channel fees. So even if you pay $50 selling channel fees, let's take it to the extreme. 
even if you pay $100 in selling channel fees, which you won't, you'll still make $350 here per transaction, which is great even to have one sell per day. So this seller is already doing it and he's doing it pretty well. And of course, you can copy the same tactics, but make the product page unique, make it your own. Use your own upselling strategies, use your own cross-selling strategies, use better apps to be able to convert the buyer. There are many things that you can do to stand out from your competition after you learn from them, after you learn from their successes, from what they're doing well and what they can improve, you will be the one to improve it and provide a much better experience for your shoppers. Our next product is a golden cutlery set. Different from your standard cutlery sets, this one is gold, it's luxury, it speaks out to people. Let's take a look at this product. This one is being sold for about $162, being sourced at around $51, leaving you with a profit potential of about $111 per sale. The target audience for this product is both male and female in terms of gender, ages 30 to 50, single and married, with a medium to high income range. Because once again, we're looking at luxury products and people in the lower financial status are usually not in the market for these types of products. Now, let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. We've got the screenshot right here, but let's get a live demonstration using the links in the blog article below this video. So here is the seller Veneto Design. Elevate your dining experience with the Farron Luxury Cutlery Set. Of course, anyone can call it whatever they want. And for some reason, Facebook is not showing me the amount of engagements, but you can see by the amount of comments that we have a lot of engagements. Okay, I can see why it's not showing it to me because I expanded it probably. You can also take a look right here when we took the screenshot. So it had 4,700 likes and shares, almost 200 comments. And that is more than enough for you to understand that this product is popular with great engagements. And we can also look at the comments below, as you can see right here. And they are also very responsive. They're answering their shoppers comments, which helps you understand as the buyer that this is a business that's actually serious and engaging with their customers. So that is a good thing. And that is also something that you want to imitate. You want to be responsive. You want to be communicative and you want to show the buyers that this business is not some robot. It actually has people sitting in the background that actually care for their customers. Now let's take a look at his product page. So it looks like we need to do another currency conversion right here. 533 comes out to about $156. Let's see if he's got more colors. Yes, he's got more colors. He's just got two colors, gold and silver, and he's giving it to you in images. So that's also kind of nice. And the set, do you want 24, 48, 30, or 60 pieces? Then you've got the shipping, and he's giving you your localized shipping, which is also kind of nice. Unless you want to ship to another country, then it's not really nice. And you've got the product's information with the images on the left side, information on the right side, including what each set includes. And please follow the care instructions to keep your cutlery in best shape. And as you see, there is a spacing issue on the care instructions, but let's just subtract one point from this seller. And he's got the care instructions right here. So he's he actually created pages on his website and wrote guides on how to use the products what, and what is the best way to maintain them. So that's a nice thing to have. Not only will it help buyers engage with his business even more when you see how much value they are providing, but you also feel like they are looking out for you and they want you to take care of their high quality products, even though it's not really theirs. And of course, they've got customer reviews. And if you scroll down even below that, you've got the frequently bought together. Now, my suggestion is this. The frequently bought together is a great thing to have. Many huge names do it like Amazon. It was way too far below. I had to scroll down a lot to get to it below the customer testimonials. It should have been above the customer testimonials because if let's say I would have but another item that goes along with it, but I only got to the customer testimonials and I just read like this one and this one and I was like, okay, I'm convinced. Let's scroll back up and buy the product. I didn't even see the other things that you wanna to sell to me, which could have been very relevant to me. So that should have been a little bit higher up. Besides that, we have You May Also Like. It's another way to get a cross sell or an upsell running here. And that is pretty much it. So that is what the seller is doing. Good job right there, but I'm sure that you can do a better job. Now let's take a look at the supplier's website. So we're looking at the variation that has gold and 24 pieces. So I'm gonna scroll down to the supplier's website, click on the link, and here we have it. So let's get to the gold, and this is a product right here. So it's being sold at $49, with free shipping to the United States, including tracking. So that is great. It's about a dollar less than what we had on the website, but that is not a big deal. So the seller is gonna make another dollar profit right here. So we sell it, he's selling it for about $156 and he's buying it for 49. So your profit potential right there, about $107 per transaction, 
not including selling fees. So as you see, these sellers are having a pretty good time selling these products, making great profit. And of course, you can do the same and even better. Our next product is a reusable lint roller. For those of you who don't know what they are, it's especially good for getting pet hair off of your clothes. But this is a reusable lint roller and not one that you throw away after one or two uses. This one is being sold for $20, being sourced at $4, leaving you a potential profit of $15.78 per transaction. It matches both male and female ages 18 to 50, single and married at any income range low medium and high it is a very low price product it's very cheap let's take a look at the seller's facebook ad his facebook page name is i need this now he's got some good engagement right here and as you see of course he's using a video to provide the best explanation of what this product does and that is doing what i explained getting it off your furniture all that hair off of your clothes and so forth are you looking for an efficient way to keep your clothes lint and hair free say goodbye to messy lint hair and dander on your clothes and furniture and say hello to the role master trademark not really a trademark, but it sure does get the job done for the online shoppers. Shop now, here's the link. Washable, reusable, sticky, free shipping today. So he gave out the right information. He didn't throw out a whole bunch of text to get you tired, but actually gave you some relevant sentences, some features and benefits, and throws you directly into the product page. So here we're looking once again, I don't like these local currency converters, but most shoppers do like them, so I can't argue with that. So right now we're looking at a selling price of $20, which is what we saw also on, on the blog page. He's got the color variations right here. And as you see, all of the product pages look almost the same, where you've got the product's images on the left side, or at least the main images that you can scroll through the variations right here, and the product's information on the right. This is because all of these websites are being hosted on Shopify. This is simply one of Shopify's most used themes, and it's completely free to use. So why wouldn't you do it, especially if it works, especially if it converts online shoppers. So now it's your job just to do the right product research and sell the right products and also target the right audiences to be able to roll in those sales and profits. So as we're seeing right here, customer testimonials imported from the supplier's website, but this seller also did the right work. The colors here, he's using mainly two colors, red and green, as you can see, the logo is red, the extra 20% right here is also in red. He's getting you to subscribe. He wants your email address so that he can send you email promotions and he'll give you a 15%. Well, here he says 15%, here he says 20%, so you can see where he's kind of going wrong right here. This can throw off your customer. Even though you wouldn't mind getting 15 or 20%, you would still leave your email address, but you wanna be professional. Do not confuse your buyers. So we got the product's title, the images, the variations, the trust badges, as we've seen from other sellers, and a quick GIF animation showing you what this product does, and more images, more animations, more explanations, more features, more benefits. Be careful not to overkill it, but as long as the information is relevant, it's completely fine. So we know that he's selling it for $20. Let's look for the supplier's website. So of course, we've got the link right here. Let's click on any variation because it doesn't matter. He's really selling them all. And free shipping. Shipping with tracking costs another 97 cents. I definitely think that it's worth it. So you're going to pay about $5, $5 and 10 cents, but you are selling it for $20. So you've got about $15 in profit per transaction for such a small and cheap item. That is a dropshipping business model. We're not here to make $1 or 5% or 10% profit per transaction. The profits here are huge. Your investment is minimum. That is why it is a low risk, high reward business model. Our next product on the list is an ultrasonic teeth cleaning device. Let's take a look. It's being sold at $40, being bought at $9 with a profit potential of $31. The target audience that you wanna target right here is both male and female, ages 18 and up, marital status, both single and married, but who have an interest in niches like self-care products and personal hygiene. Let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. Just from the screenshot, we can see that he's got over 14,000 likes, 1,300 comments, and over 4 million views. Let's click to get a better look at this ad. So as you see, he's probably using influencers right here. Let's click on, let's click on play turn down the volume. So yes, he's using influencers and also animations, most likely provided by the supplier to whip up a good video ad. And this always works. So this is the seller's ad. He's got great engagement. What he's doing here really works well and you can see why. At home tartar and stain removal is here. Stop bad breath, prevent yellow teeth, portable and rechargeable, 50% off flash sale and free shipping worldwide. 
got your interest just by looking at the video right here. And look at these comments. It's brilliant. I got one and after two times using it, I noticed a big difference. 69 people engaged with that comment and 13 replies. And here's another person. I absolutely love mine. May have to order another one. Yes, it's okay for sensitive teeth. More engagements on that one and more and more comments. Not only are we getting a lot of social proof right here that this product is working and that it's good, you can also see the amount of engagements that these buyers are getting back from other buyers who are interested in this product. So this is just creating a huge ball of social proof and customer testimonials, which is more than you need to be able to increase your engagements, increase your sales and increase your profits. Let's take a look at his website. And here you can see that he is selling it for $40. We've got the blue and pink variations, the product page. I don't really know how much this highlighting effect is helping him, but he's got the images on the left and he's got the explanations on the right. He wants to make sure that you don't copy text from his website, so I cannot right click, I cannot left click to highlight anything. That's just the way he rolls. There's an app on Shopify that you can download that will also help you do this, but I don't really see a reason why to do it, especially since he punched up a whole bunch of text right here. And I don't think it is the best strategy. But on the other hand, I think the seller got a little bit, little bit lazy because he noticed that the sales are coming in anyway. But I can guarantee that most people are not going to read all of this text. So you don't have to write it in the first place. You want to keep text short, simple and to the point unless you don't want your unless you don't want your shoppers to actually engage with it so a little bit of customer testimonials here on the bottom but you can be sure that what's bringing the conversions here is not this product page but more like this facebook ad with the crazy crazy amount of engagements and more social proof. So he's selling it for $40. Let's take a look at the supplier's website. So here we've got the same exact product, same exact variation, pink and green. Let's take a look at the prices. So we're looking at $4.92 with another $3.98 for shipping. So $4 plus $5 is $9 when you are selling the product for $40. So you've got $31 profit potential here, not including selling channel fees. So you've got about 29, 28, 27 dollars in profit, but that is still absolutely crazy for selling a product that cost you only nine dollars. Moving on to the next one in line, multi-level back massager stretcher. I'm sure that you've seen products that are similar to this, like ab rollers and other types of stretchers, but this one is actually pretty unique. It's being sold for $25, it's being sourced at $12, leaving you with a profit potential of about $13. The target audience are both male and female, ages between 20 and 45, both single and married, and those who have interests in places like health conditions, back pain, and for those who are looking for back pain reducers, back pain reliefs, and so forth. Now you do wanna be careful when running Facebook ads on these types of products, especially when you're using a before and after scheme. You simply wanna avoid those things because Facebook does not like seeing it, but let's click, let's click play, turn down the volume, and you can see this product in action. So yes, it's stretching your back, that is what it does, and that is what these people are showing you. So this ad right here got about 1,200 views. It's not too much. It's not a crazy amount of engagement, but let's take a look at his website. You can be sure that he is selling it, maybe not hundreds per day, but let's open up his website and the supplier's website. Another currency converter. He's selling it for, let's just choose a variation. So worldwide standard delivery choose one color, and here it isn't converted. So $26, which is just $1 more than we're seeing from the blog article, no big deal. And let's take a look at the seller's website. So here is the same exact product, same exact measurements, same exact variation. Let's see how much we've got with shipping, with tracking, it's free. So the product costs $10.79. So let's round that up to 11. 26 minus 11 leaves you with $15 in profit for every transaction. Great product, let's move on to the next one. Egyptian cotton duvet cover set. This is a high ticket item, leaving you high profits for every time you get a transaction. This one is selling for $346, being sourced at $177, leaving you with a profit potential of about $168 per sell. This fits both male and female ages 25 to 65, single and married with a medium to high income range. Let's take a look at the Facebook ad. This one got over 171,000 engagements in this one post, over 6,000 comments and over 13 
13 million views. Let's take a look. I'm going to click on the link to see his Facebook ad. Over 6,000 comments and over 13 million views. Let's take a look at his product page and see what he's doing right. Zaydina Luxury Embroidered Egyptian Cotton Duvet Cover Set. So that's what he calls it. And again, a currency converter. Let's see how much it really costs in USD. So we're looking at about $333. And overall, everything looks pretty much on point. We've got all the product specifications and the information on the right side, images on the left, something that we're very used to, and all of the available sizes for the different variations. So if you're not interested in one specific size, you can see everything on one page instead of flipping through the variations to see what their specifications are. Once again, customer reviews and frequently bought together. Now, you may have noticed that we have looked at the seller before and he's got the frequently bought together in the wrong place. But at the end of the day, he is doing a good job selling the right products to audiences that are interested in purchasing them. And now the most important thing is how much he's actually profiting because we know that he's making sales with that amount of engagements. So let's take a look at AliExpress and we're looking at the king size six piece flat bed sheet. So flat bed sheet, king six piece and the color, the only one that we have here. So we've got $147 with another $16 in shipping with tracking available and it will arrive in a short amount of time. I'm recording this video about a week before the estimated delivery date right here. So they actually deliver it pretty quick using UPS expedited shipping. So add $16 to 147, we're looking at $163 when he's selling it for $333, leaving him a nice profit amount of $170 per transaction. Now that is great. And that is what medium to high ticket items will give you in your dropshipping business. Now keep in mind one important thing. When you're selling expensive products, you need to do thorough product research and make sure that you are targeting the right audiences because an expensive product is harder to sell than a cheap product priced at anywhere up to 40 to $50. So items that cost 10 to $20 are much easier to sell than products that cost hundred dollars and up even if the audience is right. So keep this in mind moving forward, test out these products, see what starts to move, see what starts to gain interest and continue your way up from there. The next product on our list is a wing pendant crystal necklace. Let's take a look. This one is being sold for almost $40. It's being sourced for just $9, leaving you with a profit potential of almost $30 per sale. This one is right for females, so do not target males. You can try to target males who have girlfriends, who have wives, who have fiancés, and they want to get them a gift. But women are more likely to engage with this product and simply purchase it directly for themselves. So females aged 20 to 50, single and married, who are interested in categories like fashion accessories and jewelry. By the way, good job making it this far, guys. It shows that you are interested and that you are serious about finding the right products to sell on your dropshipping business. Let me show you a neat little trick before we continue. So let's say that you actually want to sell this product on your store. So what you want to do is find the right supplier who you want to add it from. Of course, you've got the AliExpress links in our blog article, but let's say you want to go for a supplier who resides in the United States. So for example, you can go with many suppliers. I'm just going to go with Amazon as the example here. So wing pendant crystal necklace, let's say you want to tackle this niche and start selling it. So let's go for this one right here, cost $39.99. It's got a lot of reviews and we've got a coupon where we can actually make more profit. Now we've got all of these variations right here and you can add all of them to your store in just a matter of seconds. You can also later on decide what variations you want to keep, which ones you want to remove and even add more variations from other suppliers on one product page, making it very unique for you. Let's see how this is done. I'm going to simply copy the whole URL, then I'll head over to the AutoDS platform. Go to AutoDS.com if you don't have an account yet. Then I'm going to click on add products. And in this case, I'm going to go with single product since it's only one but you can do the same process to hundreds or even thousands of products at once at the same time. I'm going to paste the URL right here and then I'll click on edit now quick. Now what's happening is in really literally less than a second and a half, the system grabbed all of the product's information from the supplier's page and simply transferred it right here to the draft section of our store. Now here we can start optimizing the product, like the name, the collection, the tags. It really depends on what selling channel you are using, then you'll see relevant things for you. The monitoring, so the price monitoring, stock monitoring, and automatic orders, which is a small amount of the features and benefits that you have when using AutoDS as your dropshipping automation tool. And you've got the product's description, so of course you can optimize it, make it look really good, add your brand's name, remove the bad English, replace it with professional English, add images, 
images, add videos, look at all of the variations. They are all in stock and they are all going to be on my product page. And really guys, all of this information got imported in less than one and a half seconds. We didn't do any cutting, any editing in that certain part of the video, just so you can really get a feeling of how fast this is being done. Then you've got all of the products images. So all of that got imported when I added the products URL and the item specification. In this case, only one was automated. We can add much, much more item specifications and we can also add them in the products description page. Now, once you are done, you simply click on save and import, and then it'll move from the drafts to the product section of your store, meaning now it's live and anyone can go and purchase it. That is just one quick, neat little trick of how you can automate your business and be able to scale it and make much more sales and profit from your dropshipping business. Let's continue with this wing pendant crystal necklace. Let's scroll down and take a look at the Facebook ad. So here we can see on this ad that he's got 11,000 interactions, 11,000 engagements, likes and hearts with 660 comments and 680 shares. That is a pretty nice number. Now let's take a look at the ad itself. So we're looking at right here, really quick one sentence ad, give her what she needs and protect her as always. Period, heart, heart, get one here. I have a feeling that English is not the strong side of the seller. He's not really good at whipping up his own creatives for product descriptions and copywriting for your ads and so forth. But if you're selling the right product to the right audience, it's gonna work. It's gonna look like this. The comment section is simply gonna be banging with comments with happy comments, happy customers, and people who are simply interested in purchasing this product. So you can see that that is what we're looking at right here. Now let's take a look at their website. And here we've got all kinds of different variations. Let's see which one we will lock into. So I'm going to also open up the product on AliExpress. Here's the variation right here. You can see on AliExpress, it costs $4.89. And you can agree with me that it is the same exact product that we're looking at on the seller's website. So $4.89. Now let's ch check out shipping. It costs almost as much as the product, but hey, at least tracking is available. So we've got $3.47 and $4.89. And $8.36. And he's selling it for $39. So 39 minus eight is about $31. And that is how much profit this seller is making from selling a really cheap angel wings pendant necklace, which looks expensive because he made his product page look that way. But at the end of the day, that is the product that you are getting. That is how much you are paying for it. And that is how much you are profiting. Isn't the dropshipping business model great? Let's continue. This product page is a little bit messy. We've seen similar things before, but he's got the important information. He's got the product specifications. And by the way, you can see that he changed the highlight color. It's this uh, yellowy, it's this yellowy highlight color. He's got the about us or about him, about Viennas and shipping returns and service. You, so once again, the English isn't the strong side of the seller, but he's making sales. He's doing what he set out to do. And this should give you a good example of how you can do a much, much better job. Our last product in line are pumpkin pet combs. That's what the product is. It is a comb. It's for your pets and it's shaped or colored like a pumpkin. This one is being sold for $30, being bought only for $7, leaving you with a potential profit of about $23 minus selling channel fees. It fits both male and female ages 20 to 60, both single and married. Look for audiences who have an interest in pets, in pet care products and who are simply pet lovers all around. Now let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. So this is the product in action. We've got background music, which I always turn down because it simply bothers me from talking. But as you can see right here, it's taking out all the pet hairs. It's combing your cat, combing your pet, and it's doing the job that it's set out to do. This cat is actually having a good time. And I would think that most cats would enjoy this type of comb. Most cats love being petted, right? But the important thing is it simply works. Let's take a closer look. So we've got 468,000 views on this ad right here, up to $20 off, a whole bunch of text, which I don't think is uh, aligned correctly, but let's click on his website, pumpkin pet comb. He says that he sold 4.55K units, I don't think that's true, but I do think that he sold a few hundred at the very, very least. So you've got the variations right here, three different colors. If you buy two, you'll save $8. And that is completely fine because he's making much more profit than that. And I've got this pop-up telling me to leave my email address and get up to 50% off in my email. And I didn't have a choice. I got that pop-up in my face. If I close it, it's fine. It's fine to have it one time. If it happens more than once, you are annoying your potential shoppers. It looks like your average Shopify theme, as I already mentioned in this video, Video. you might also like no frequently bought together no upselling no cross-selling not that good 
I'm sure that you're already thinking how you can do it better than this. But he is making those sales. Let's see how much this product really costs. So going down to the supplier's website should be for around $7. Let's see if it's true. Let's see if anything changed. So I'm going to go with the pumpkin green, $2.75, but we do have to take the shipping into consideration. Shipping for another $5.11, so that comes out to about $7, $8. So once again, the figures are correct. Now, tell me if the dropshipping business model is crazy or not. People are making substantial profits from selling items that are really, really cheap, but they're selling it, they're marking it up, they're making great profits. We are not here for small profits. And I hope that this video helped you understand how you can make some great profits and even even some sellers who are not doing such a good job are still able to make some great sales because they are selling the right product to the right audience. Now, if you practice the same thing, the same successful business practices, but make it even better with your upselling and cross-selling techniques, with your product specifications, with your product page, with the way that you brand your products and the way that you market them, the audiences that you decide to target and the regions around the world that you have access to, the opportunities are endless as well as your profit potential. I hope that this video helped you understand what are some of the best products that you can sell for the month of September, along with all of the information that we provided. Do not forget that we'll leave a link to the blog article right below this video so you can see everything in action, see all of the sellers' websites, all of their Facebook ads, all of the source links, and be able to create a success story of your own. Do not forget that without dropshipping automation, you will be very limited to the amount of sales and profit that you can make. So if you really want to make it to the high numbers, if you're really serious about your dropshipping business, use AutoDS, the number number one automated dropshipping platform out there and enjoy price monitoring, stock monitoring, automatic orders, quick product importing, great customer service, and so, so much more. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to always learn about the next step in your e-commerce business. Leave me a comment below if you have any questions or comments and good luck with your product research.